is Manchester United 1, Brighton Munich 3, Manchester United losing all the three points, getting humiliated at Old Trafford, finally losing at Old Trafford, it is not a fortress anymore, Brighton Munich came down with a storm from the sunny beach, flooded our area, flooded Old Trafford, yes, for the first time fans have booed the plant at half time, booed the players at full time, it has been an Absolute disgrace of a match for us fans. What a joke. Do you really think? You know what? Yeah, we've had a one hell of an international break. We haven't even been playing at all. But guess what? Keeping up at Carrington just keeps airing and airing. We've had a bad week. Jaden Sancho, Anthony, I mean, Anthony as well with the allegations as well. And again, Sancho, Sancho, all this nonsense as well. Harry Maguire, Harry Maguire's mom coming out as well. And then when it comes to the actual game, these players fold like fucking pieces of shit. Pieces of shit, Manchester United players. And I'm, I'm, I'm fed up with this kind of style. You know what? The manager as well, absolutely uh, as a part of it to be blamed as well. But these players, I would, I will push them right off the cliff. Cliff, especially a lot of these players, Bruno Fernandes as well, Mark Rashford for that time. Just shit. Decision makings are poor as well. Couldn't even find Hoyland. Hoyland in position as well. Guys, I'm so upset. But but you know what? Who I wouldn't push up the cliff? Probably someone. Maybe Varane. Definitely Martinez and Casemiro. But even though Casemiro had a shit game today. Manchester United have let the fans down. We are outraged with what we saw. Like We want our football club back. We want our football club back. As Manchester United fans were chanting during that game. What an absolute disgrace, you know. How are you going to do this? Another week for us to get trolled on? Do we, do we get... Oh, I'm fed up, guys. I'm so fed up. I am so annoyed. Seriously. Overall, looking at that first 45 minutes, that match as well. Match United. What? You can only give us 20 minutes. 20 minutes of a good time. And when those 20 minutes, you can't even fucking score. You can't even get a goal in at all. Can't break the line. Just like against Arsenal, Manchester United give you 20 minutes of good times and good stuff. But at the end of the day, it's cheap frills. It's cheap frills. And we received cheap frills. As soon as we conceded the first goal, we folded. Danny Welbeck as well, the boogeyman against Manchester United. Always scoring against us as well. Just loves it. Loves it as well, man. Scoring that first goal so damn easy, cutting the ball back, and then he's getting well back himself, being able to tap it in. Manchester United looking shit, and Onana keeps conceding goals. The defense is even worse than what it was last season. Huh. <sighs> In that 45 minutes, Manchester United were being dominated by Brighton Munich. Brighton as well, keeping possession. Looking at the home side. Manchester United is fucking folding as always, man. This team makes me sick at times, man. To watch that match. And it was 1-0 at half time for Brighton. The second half, I'm like, Tenog, throw these men out. Straight away, throw them to the fishes. They better, they better step up, you know. Throw them straight into the deep end and give him a bulletin at half time and we was thinking okay he's gonna give him a bulletin we're gonna turn around things turn things around but in my heart in my head i just knew it we wasn't gonna turn things around and it got worse in the second half guys a goal from fucking fucking pat skull gross as well another opportunity another cut back by mitomo oh my god God, Manchester United as well, conceding that goal so easy, and it was so early in the second half, and then it was like, what, the 50th minute, you know, and then 3-0 Jao Pedro, Manchester United by that time was just done, the Manchester United fans booed the players at half time, and they continued to boo them, in fact, left at 3-0, especially when we scored that, so conceded that third goal, you know, and of course, Hannibal giving us a consolation goal, but we don't give a shit. I don't even know why you're celebrating Hannibal. Why are you celebrating Hannibal? What's the point? What is the point of all of that shit? I know you scored probably your first goal for Manchester United. You're very happy. But to me, I just think it was not needed. Get the ball and uh, straight away go to the halfway line and continue playing. This is the mentality that we're supposed to have. But look at this situation. This team is just a joke. We are trash. We are fucking shit. Really and truly, like, what I've been seeing so far with the players, even the manager as well, with the mistakes, to the extent that we have Bruno Fernandes, one of the horrible players, one of our horrible players, one of our worst players in that, in that game, playing centre-back. 
this match, I know he refuses to play Harry Maguire, but really and truly, look at that, man. It's just clueless behavior, it's clueless decision making as well. And it makes me want to raise my eyebrows towards Eric Tenog and think, hmm? what are you doing? What are you doing? And then we've got by me to play. Oh my god, my head is hot. The headaches, guys. We're going to get moved to by Bayern Munich. We're going to get absolutely embarrassed. Seriously. Can you believe it? No, I, I, I just can't take it as a Manchester United fan. You know, keeping it up at Carrington. We should be sponsored. Not not by our current team view. We should be sponsored by Channel E Entertainment, bro. Because that's what it is for Manchester United. We're just pure entertainment to, to the watchers, the viewers. Seriously. This has been bad, bad, bad. Look at the player-wise... I thought today Reglan was all right in terms of game position and getting forward and defending well. Mark Rashford as well. Look for your man. Look for your man. You as well has been shit today. You know, you've been... You cannot play as as a pair up front. You don't look for your man. Hoyland feeds you in. Cut the ball. Bring it back to him so he can tap it in. You just can't see it, you blind bat. Rashford turned into Marcus Trashford. Trash Bandicoot today. And Hoyland as well did decent until he came off. The fans were furious when he came off, you know. 61 minutes, they were not happy with Ten Hag decision making. I'm telling you, there's something wrong with Manchester United as well. Bruno Fernandes is dog shit. Again, another game, flat track bully against the smaller teams. But the good teams, you just can't do shit, man. And Casemiro had one of the worst games he's ever had, guys. Ten Hag as well as a manager today, I thought he was poor. Absolute piss pats, bruv. Man of the match today goes to you fans, as well us Man United fans for watching this shit. Don't give the match. Casemiro poor. Well, a lot of them was poor, man. It's been a, a shit match to watch, man. And we've got Bright Bayern Munich next, bruv. Really do, guys. Guys, you guys let me know your thoughts in the comments. Who was your man in the match as well? Who's your donkey of the match as well? And of course. We Monday we will go again again with a full match reaction with the guys. And don't forget to subscribe, smash that like button, share across all social media platforms. This has been your match reaction, guys. Remember to keep it united if you can. But also remember to keep it red united because your boy is out. Peace. I'm so furious.